Hey guys, I'm currently on day six of NoFap. I failed two times on the, two, the second and the third of this year, but I instead changed my view on it. I said that I needed more time, and because I need more time, I could uh, afford to spend like half an hour for four or five minutes jerking off, and it's like an hour in total, because then you're, because then you're. You're searching for the video, you're getting the tissue ready, you get you get this, the actual process, 15, 20 minutes. I lost 15, 20 minutes. And then it's just and then the cleanup afterwards, come on guys. It's all over your fucking chest, the walk of shame and everything. I'm tired of doing that shit. The height of the no fat thing, uh, no, the height of then I can't say no fat, but the height of being um, horny isn't actually the act of the thing coming. It's actually just staying horny, because that horniness, that intense boiling feeling within deep inside your heart, that type of feeling is the thing feeling like it's you working. Anyways, and plus, it, it, uh, it links in with today's video as well. Um, thing. It links in with today's video as well. Uh, rejuvenating sleep, which I really, really wanted to figure out how you get rejuvenating sleep. I've only experienced rejuvenating sleep a handful of times. Only a handful of times. Within my 17 years of existence, I've only experienced it a handful of times. And rejuvenating sleep is best described when I say describe it as when I say it as you, you go to sleep, you're exceptionally tired when you go to sleep. But once you wake up, you're exceptionally refreshed. You feel very you feel very sharp, very, very refreshed, and you're like immediately back able to go to work. And it's your body actually functioning at full optimal capacity by actually healing you in your sleep. You really feel healed. I had, I did like around 20 pull ups yesterday. Like, I don't know, I think it was like six, no, it was, it was like five per set. And I just banged them out within seconds like one, two, three, four, five. Five second break, ten second break, one, two, three, four, five. And then my arm's hurting a bit, bit of a shoulder injury and bicep injury, maybe. And I really, really wanted to get that rejuvenating sleep so I could heal quickly in order to go back into what I could, I could be doing. I could go back to exercising. My wrist are burst from boxing. My foot is burst from boxing. Sort of burst now from fucking pull ups. I'm supposed to be in the prime time of my life. Not necessarily. A male prime is 35 years old. But I'm supposed to be young and bustling and healing quick and all over the place. But I'm just getting injuries all over the place. So I don't even understand what's going on. I'm assuming it's from overwork. So I'm eating a lot of carbs, mashed potatoes, rice, uh, meat, veggies. Because carbs heal and protein builds new muscle. And we got my dog here with me. Yum, 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 yum. <laughs> Get down. Chicky not dead. Wah, 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 wah. Be alright, guys. <laughs> I got my food right here, potatoes, I'm eating mashed potatoes and I'm eating potatoes as well, amazing. Potato heaven, am I right? Carb heaven. So for the next month, I'm making this video as a um, try, like a, like, a, like a little statement video. Okay, a little statement video. For the next month, I'll be spending 30 days for the next month and probably the rest of my entire life dedicating a small portion of my life to figuring out how to get rejuvenating sleep and I think I'll get it within easily within three to six months that's a large time frame that's an absurd time frame I think I'll get it within a month I get a, um, things because that's 30 days that's 30 times you can get to try out rejuvenating sleep tactics I think it's so important because 
if you're an athlete like me, or even if you're, you're a 9 to 5 worker going through around his life, sleep is such an important thing. Because sometimes you feel like you don't get enough of it, or sometimes you get too much. And even when you do get too much, it doesn't work enough. I remember I was sleeping like 15 hours, 16 hours, and it did not feel like I was fully rested up. But there was other times where I slept 9 hours, 10 hours, and it felt like my body was just reconstructing itself from the core, from the down below, from the very foundation of my body. It felt like I was getting reconstructed, and I felt very, very good about myself waking up. So I'm chasing that feeling, I'm chasing that rejuvenating sleep. I, I heard before that you need to have like enough physical activity within the day in order to activate the rejuvenating sleep, which I find absolute bullshit. Because I, I train very hard. I don't have rejuvenating sleep, so what the fuck's going on? I train very hard. I train very hard. I exercise very hard. I exercise quite frequently. I haven't missed a workout. In like six months, I missed one workout in six months. My habit tracker. I don't think I need to put it on there anymore. For next month, I'm gonna be embarking on a journey to figure out. Really cool. Look at me with eating. Catch you guys next video. Sui.